Hello. Welcome to the Fabrico Design Channel. We develop professional sewing patterns and make them available to every woman. Using our patterns and video instructions, you can easily sew any garment at home and feel like a designer. And today we are going to sew a radius sweatshirt. This oversized sweatshirt features horizontal cuts on the front and back, rib knit band on the neckline and waistband on the bottom. Sleeves feature a cut-off decorative piece and cuffs at the bottom. The left sleeve features a pocket from decorative fabric with a zipper. As usual, you can download the PDF pattern of this sweatshirt below the video in the description box. For sewing, these pants choose knitted fabrics of medium stretch, such as two or three thread French terry. Ribbed knit is perfect for the neckline, cuffs and waistband. Satin, raincoat fabric, and denim are good choices for the decorative pocket. You will also need a coil zipper, interfacing tape, and the jacketing tape. Let's get cutting. It's highly important to decate the fabric before cutting to prevent it from shrinking during sewing. We lay out the patterns on the fabric observing directions of the grain line. It is indicated on the patterns and trace the patterns along the counter. Do not forget to transfer all control marks onto the cutting pieces. So, cut the pieces. After cutting, double check the number of pieces according to the pattern pieces list. And do not forget to interface the pieces as indicated on the patterns. Let's get sewing. Let's start with the front. Sew the upper piece of the front to the middle part of the front, placing the pieces right sides together. Press the seam allowances up. Top stitch along the upper piece at 0.5 centimeter from the stitching seam. Sew the lower piece of the front to the middle part of the front, placing the pieces right sides together. Press the seam allowances down. Top stitch along the lower piece at 0.5 centimeter from the stitching seam. We're moving on to the back. Interface the shoulder cut of the back. Sew the upper piece of the back to the middle piece of the back, placing the pieces right sides together. Press the seam allowances up. Top stitch along the upper piece at 0.5 centimeter from the stitching seam. Sew the lower piece of the back to the middle piece of the back, folding the pieces right sides together. Press the seam allowances down. Top stitch along the bottom piece at 0.5 centimeter from the stitching seam. Now the assembling. Place the front onto the back right sides inward and stitch the shoulder seams. Press the allowances onto the back. Sewing the neckline. Sew the neckband into a ring. Press the seam allowances apart. Trim seam allowances.
press seam allowances in half. Sew the band into the neck opening using an overlocker. Match the band seam with the left shoulder seam. Iron the seam allowances onto the sweatshirt. Sew a jacketing tape to the back neckline. We recommend decating it first. The length of the jacketing tape is equal to the length of the back neckline from the shoulder seams, plus two centimeters for turning in the allowances. Fold the seam allowances of the jacketing tape, one centimeter on each side to the wrong side, and top stitch its upper edge to the back neck allowance. Top stitch the lower edge all the way along the back piece. Press. Making the sleeve. Sew the cutoff piece of the sleeve into the sleeve folding the pieces right sides together. Press the seam allowances onto the cutoff piece view from the wrong side. Top stitch along the cutoff piece of the sleeve at 0.5 centimeter from the stitching seam. Let's proceed to the pocket. Top pocket overlock along the top edge and press along the notches of the pocket entrance line. Fold the allowance to the right side and stitch the allowances to the width of the hem. Turn inside out and press. Press the side and bottom pocket seam allowances. Mark the stitching lines for the inner pocket on the lower pocket. Stitch it on three sides. Press. Press and overlock the edge under the zipper on the lower pocket. Stitch one side of the zipper, placing it right sides together with the fabric. Leave an allowance of one centimeter at the top and bottom of the edge. Stitch the zipper and press. Sew the other side of the zipper to the pocket placket in the same way. Press. Top stitch on both sides of the zipper, 0.1 centimeter wide. Press the lower pocket on all sides. Mark the stitching lines for the pocket on the left sleeve and stitch it at 0.1 centimeter from the edge. Press.
sew the sleeve into the open armhole, folding the pieces right sides together. Press the seam allowances onto the sweatshirt. Sew the side seams together with the sleeve. To do this, pin it with pins, aligning all the notches and seams. Press the seam allowances onto the back. Sew the cuff into a ring and press it in half. Place the cuffs into the sleeves, right sides together. Pin the cuffs and sew on an overlocker. Press the seam allowances onto the sleeve. And finally, the waistband. Sew the belt into a ring. Press the seam allowances apart and press it in half. Place the waistband with the bottom of the sweatshirt right sides together and stitch, gathering the bottom. Press the allowances onto the sweatshirt. Give the sweatshirt a final press. Thanks for sewing with us. Subscribe to our channel and publish your photos in different social medias and tag us. You can find the link to our website in the description box below the video.